Yo, 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 Mitsu Head presents, ooh, through all the bullet holes, I call them bullet holes because it just sounds more gangster, but <clears throat> anyway, uh, how you guys doing, how's everybody, I know I ask that every time, but I want to be courteous, because I'm a courteous kind of guy, so, uh, updates, things in my life, a few of you have asked me where I've been, uh, without being too morbid, uh, my wife's grandmother died, uh, a couple weeks ago, so just been trying to get back to uh, normal life from there. Um, we got her two cats. She was quite the uh, she was quite the animal lover, and we got her two cats. One of them has some problems, so um, you know it's it's our lives are my, me and my wife. Uh, our lives have been a little bit changed by that. So uh, just a little bit more responsibility, you know, we're still in a tiny apartment and now we got two fully grown cats when we didn't have any pets before, so, so things are a little bit different. Um, but again, without being, getting too morbid, just things have been insanely busy with the move and um, a couple weddings coming up this year. But, uh, you know, there, there is light at the end of the tunnel, you know, um, you know, things have been uh, still up on the up and up. You know, uh, God's been very gracious to my wife and I. So, regardless, you know, things are great. But, um, you know, updates for right now. Basically, you know, just kind of working right now. My car is paid off one year from now. So, I'm very excited about that because I'll be able to, we'll, you know, we'll be able to save a little bit more. Hopefully, get a motorcycle or something like that soon. My dad has been riding motorcycles for at least 30 years and he's all. He, you know, he, he has pretty much had every motorcycle you can think of, so yeah, kind of looking forward to uh, to grabbing one of those, just because my car gets about five miles to the gallon, but it's that like that for a reason, so um, I don't really mind that too much. Um, this gameplay is just a little while ago. Actually, it's probably about three, three months ago. Um, you know, nothing really special. I know some people have... <laughs> I, I apologize. Some people have asked for uh, Thompson gameplay for a while now, and this is pretty much the best I can come up with because I'm horrible with that gun. Um, great gun in real life. I respect it. Uh, it's a classic. It's a legend in World War II, but in my hands, in a, in a video game, it's just, uh, it's just crap. So I don't really like it too much. I don't really like using it too much, but um, I'd rather use a Grand. I'm going to use anything from World War II in this game. But regardless, um, the end of this year, you know, my wife and I prayed for, you know, just a good vacation, something that we could afford before we had a child. At the end of the year, we're, we're planning on, you know, trying to trying to have a baby. But, um, you know, we prayed about it and much to, you know, God is so gracious to us. So check this out. You know, we're, we're, we're thinking in Hawaii or something like that. You know, we're thinking... Something really just nice, you know, something major, not like going to Jersey or something like that. And <laughs> Stryker, if he hears this, he'll, he'll, he'll laugh. I'm not saying anything bad about Jersey, but I live in Pennsylvania, and, you know, a lot of people, when they do go on vacation or when they go somewhere, they go down the shore. Jersey Shore. Because it's right nearby. It's, you know, an hour down the road, so that's my little explanation. But my wife works at a dental company that is Jewish-owned. Now, their 100th year is 2012. The year when the world is going to end, remember? But, uh, and basically they pulled everybody into the conference room. My mom works there, by the way, as well. That's who got my wife the job there. So, uh, they pulled everybody in the conference room and basically said, you know, our 100th year is, is, uh, 2012, and for, to celebrate that, we're going to send everybody to Israel. Yeah, Israel, the promise, the, uh, the promised land, you know, the, 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 the hot spot so <clears throat> we're very excited about that you know my church actually sends people uh, probably about 50 uh, on a trip you know it's, it's about four grand so uh, it's pretty major but uh, a church goes every year and we just can't really afford it and that is my pizza going off in the oven so I'll be right back Alright, just had to turn that off so my Elios wasn't burnt, but um, because that's my din din. But uh, what's it called? What was I gonna say? What was that? Oh, yeah, Israel. Um, normally it's about four grand a person, and uh, they said though, you know, the company said that they would send my wife and my mom for free, and spouses, depending on how long the 
person has been working there can go for 25 to 75% off. So basically, for me, my mom, my dad, and my wife, we're all going for the price of one person. So it is, uh, it's very exciting. Um, things are a little bit more tense there than they have been for a long time. Sniping somebody with the Thompson. Um, things have been tense there, a little bit more tense there than they have ever have been for a couple of years now. So, you know, it, I really, I don't care if there's bombs going off over there. I want to go. I've always wanted to go to Israel. You know, it's, you know, it's the, it's, it's like the birth of civilization. Yeah, it's, it's just, it's Israel. You know, like, um, huge supporter of it. Um, you know. I know there's a whole lot of politics and people get angry about everything revolving around Israel, but uh, regardless of that, um, just very excited to go, very excited to experience that. Um, chance of a lifetime, you know, it really wasn't even, you know, should we or shouldn't we go. It was like, alright, how many other times are you going to <clears throat> basically go to Israel for free? Overall, you... You can't really number that on your hand because there's just it's, it's usually never going to happen. So, um, you know, regardless of what's going on over there, very, very excited to go over there. But um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, this year for games, of course, everybody knows Battlefield 3 is coming out. Not soon enough, but uh, yeah, not really too many games coming out this summer. You know, summer for gamers, it's always a drought. Oh, yeah, PSN, PSN Network. Um, I just talked to a couple people and, and you know, I, I know I'm kind of late to it, but I, uh, I decided to play Black Ops for, you know, I got it back from one of my buddies and PSN Network was down. I mean, Netflix worked, uh, I could still go on the PlayStation Store, but the whole network was down. It's just kind of crazy and, you know, rumors are flying around. Was it hackers or what is it? Was it this or that? But, uh, yeah, that's, that's lame. That's lame for you, uh, for your PS3 guys. Sorry, you gotta go through that. I did notice a crazy influx in Xbox uh, people on my on my friends list. Usually, you know, on a weeknight there's about 15 people online, but this time there was like 25, 30. I was like, holy crap! But uh, yeah, just a quick update. Just want to get a commentary out to you guys. I know some of you've been asking for one, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, oh yeah, I got uh, I got in the top five on Battlefield. Um, top five plays on Machinima, so I'm number four, and everybody cried about me quick scoping. Why? I'm not sure in the comments, but be sure to check that out. So, um, this is uh, Mitsu, just saying uh, what's up to you guys, and I'll see you next time. Peace.